An unprecedented dig is taking place right now at the Alamo downtown. A team of archaeologists trying to find ancient artifacts and the original location of the Alamo walls. But as Case at 12's Josh Gordick reports, it has some wondering about the future of other historic buildings. Right now, four archaeologists are using shovels and trowels to find artifacts as little as one and a quarter inch thick. Now, they expect to find ceramic shards, pieces of glass, and even Indian artifacts. But at about two feet underground, they'll be looking for the big gold, the original locations of the west and south walls of the Alamo. Right now, the site is designing a new master plan called Reimagine the Alamo. The dig should give them information to decide how they want Texans to experience the historic battlefield. For the master plan team to really get a sense of where the world heritage boundaries exist and how they're going to develop the site, they really need to know where those walls were when this was a mission and then subsequently through the battle period. Now another part of the plan included the land grant office buying three historic buildings in December, the Crockett, the Palace, and the Woolworth. If the scientists are correct, the west wall runs right into them, a problem if they decide to build a wall here on the historic location. There's no predetermined ideas. There is nothing that's already been planned or scheduled for these buildings to be there or not to be there. Now, as for the future of the Alamo Plaza Street, that discussion should begin in the fall. All of the work should be done in about eight years. Reporting at the Alamo, Josh Gurnick, KSAT 12 News.